What's going on guys, Talonflame HD here and welcome back to Mass Effect. In the last episode we received the Normandy after Captain Anderson stand down, we were made a Spectre and we went after Liara Tassoni on Therum. We landed on Therum, took out some Geth, now we've cr well, now we've got to proceed on foot, let's get into it. Oh, that was a rocket. Get the drop and like flies. Just how it should be. Although we will need a sniper rifle for the next bit. Oh, balls. No, this is not stable. Sit down. Rifle. Oh. Holy shit, fuck up. What? Who else is shooting? That little bitch. He's down. Champion. I really wish I could bring the make up here. It would make things a whole lot easier. Right, we're gonna save it here, just in case we go down. Let's continue. It's above you. Ashley's down. I'm not sure if I can respond myself. Still alive, Kevin, please. Right, and now it's just the armature. Kevin's down. Yes! Now, Kitten and Ashley get back up. Think we got him, Commander. Let's see what we got. Shock absorbers, don't need them. Don't need them. Uh, don't need the toxic seals. Don't need the high. I really didn't need the high caliber barrel, but, you know. Right. Come on, go rounds two. Oh. Come back around one on the pistol. That's it. 
Now we can head inside. What is it with this game and long ass tunnels? Like seriously. Come on. Yo, shit, we can't hit the target. Shoot the legs. That's it. Uh, more elevator banter. Or the game can just stop. Yo, what the hell? <sighs> really? You took like... 10 seconds to load just one bit of text. <sighs> that is not banter. I like the ones that we saw in Eden Prime. These are a lot more sophisticated. And they're down. Can you hear me out there? I'm trapped. I need help. Keep your voice down, bitch. Quit shouting. This place is crawling with geth. Sorry, I am a little... Look, my name is Dr. Liara Tassoni. I am an archaeologist. Listen, this thing I'm in is a Prothean security device. I cannot move, so I need you to get me out of it, alright? There's some kind of repulsion field in the way. It's, it's a, a Prothean barrier curtain. I knew it would keep me safe from the Geth. When I turned it on, I must have hit something I wasn't supposed to. I was trapped in here. You must get me out, please. We'll find some way to help you. There is a control in here that should deactivate this thing. You'll have to find some way past the barrier curtain. That's the tricky part. The defenses cannot be shut off from the outside. I don't know how you'll get in here. Be careful. There is a Krogan with the Geth. They have been trying different ways to get past the barrier. A Krogan? I should have brought mine with me. Yo, that was a hit as well. Are you serious? Take it out. Thank you. Missed. Shot. Not bad shooting, guys. Not bad shooting at all. Before I use the manning laser, I'm going to collect a few items from the storage containers at the top.
Yeah, I don't need any of those, so we'll just scrap them. There should be one more. There it's at. Just put the cord in, that's it. I'll keep the two weapons. I'll... Uh, no, I don't need the recoil dampener. Then we head back down to the laser and enter the cord. The cord should be A, B, or not. A, X, B, Y, even. And to repeat that, the code was A, X, B, and Y. Just take the elevator up to Liara. How? How did you get in here? I didn't think there was any way past the barrier. We have to get you out of here before more Geth arrive. Yes, you're right. I've seen enough of them to last a lifetime. That button should shut down my containment field. Hold on, Commander. Her mother's working with Saren. Can we trust What's her? Going? I am not my mother. I don't even... I don't know why Benezia joined Saren. I don't want anything to do with that Turian bastard. If she was with Saren, the Geth wouldn't be trying to kill her. How we get out of this place? There is an elevator back in the center of the tower. At least I I think it's an elevator. It should take us out of here. Come on. Okay. I I still cannot believe all this. Why would the Geth come after me? Do you think Benezia is involved? Saren's looking for the conduit. You're a Prothean expert. He probably wants you to help him find it. The conduit, but I don't know. What the hell was that? These ruins are not stable. That mining laser must have triggered a seismic event. Wonderful. We have to hurry. The whole place is caving in. Joker, get the Normandy airborne and lock in on my signal. On the double, mister! Aye, aye, Commander. Secure and away. ETA, eight minutes. Not much margin for error. We'll be fine. We are Alliance Marines. We fight or we die. Just kill him. We don't have time to deal with this idiot. Charge! <sighs> I like your attitude. Get ready, yes. It's the Corbin Battle Master. Be careful of He is obviously by that One last guess to get rid of. Let's get out of here.
anytime soon. And I like how the Normies, Normandies are just hovering there, just... Oh, you're coming out of, like, ruins that have been destroyed. We won't send any help. You'll be fine. Thanks, Joker. Too close, Commander. Ten more seconds we would have been swimming in molten sulfur. The Normandy isn't equipped to land in exploding volcanoes. They tend to fry our sensors and melt our hull. Just for future reference. We almost died out there, and your pilot is making jokes? Sometimes Joker's a real ass. Just try to ignore him. <laughs> I see. It must be a human thing. I don't have a lot of experience dealing with your species, Commander. But I am grateful to you. You saved my life back there, and not just from the volcano. Those Geth would have killed me or dragged me off to Saren. What did Saren want with you? Do you know something about the conduit? Only that it was somehow connected to the Prothean extinction. That is my real area of expertise. I have spent the past 50 years trying to figure out what happened to them. Just how old are you exactly? I hate to admit it, but I am only 106. Damn! I hope I look that good when I'm your age. A century may seem like a long time to a short-lived species like yours. But among the Asari, I am barely considered more than a child. That is why my research has not received the attention it deserves. Because of my youth, other Asari scholars tend to dismiss my theories on what happened to the Protheans. Did your research turn up anything interesting? What is interesting is what I did not turn up. There is remarkably little archaeological evidence of the Protheans, and even less that might explain why they disappeared. It is almost as if someone did not want the mystery solved. It is like someone came along after the Protheans were gone and cleansed the galaxy of clues. But here is the incredible part. According to my findings, the Protheans were not the first galactic civilization to mysteriously vanish. This cycle began long before them. What cycle? What are you talking about? The galaxy is built on a cycle of extinction. Each time a great civilization rises up, it is suddenly and violently cast down. Only ruins survive. The Protheans rose up from a single world until their empire spanned the entire galaxy. Yet even they climbed to the top on the remains of those who came before. Their greatest achievements, the mass relays and the citadel, are based on the technology of those who came before them. And then, like all the other forgotten civilizations throughout galactic history, the Protheans disappeared. I have dedicated my life to figuring out why. They were wiped out by a race of sentient machines. The Reapers. The... the Reapers? But I have never heard of... How do you know this? What evidence well, do you have? Well... You remember the beacon on Eden Prime? There was a damaged Prothean oh, wait, she wouldn't know about Eden that. Prime. It burned a vision into my brain. I'm still trying to sort out what it all means. Visions? Yes, that makes sense. The beacons were designed to transmit information directly into the mind of the user. Finding one that still works is extremely rare. No wonder the Geth attacked Eden Prime. The chance to acquire a working beacon, even a badly damaged one, is worth almost any risk. But the beacons were only programmed to interact with Prothean physiology. Whatever information you received would have been confused, unclear. I am amazed you were able to make sense of it at all. A lesser mind would have been utterly destroyed by the process. You must be remarkably strong-willed, Commander. This isn't helping us find Saren, or the Conduit. Of course, you are right. I am sorry, my scientific curiosity got the better of me. Unfortunately, I do not have any information that could help you find the Conduit, or Saren. I don't know why Saren wanted you out of the picture, but I think we'll be a lot better off if we bring you along. Thank you, Commander. Saren might come after me again. I cannot think of anywhere safer than here on your ship. And my knowledge of the Protheans might be useful later on. And her biotics will come in handy when the fighting starts. We've already got every other non-human species on board. Might as well add Nasari to the team. Thank you, Commander. I am very grateful. Oh, I am afraid I am feeling a bit lightheaded. When was the last time you ate? Or slept? Dr. Chakwa should take a look at you. It is probably just mental exhaustion, coupled with the shock of discovering the Protheans' true fate. I need some time to process all this. Still, it could not hurt to be examined by a medical professional. It will give me the chance to 
think things over. Are we finished yep. here, Commander? Go see the doctor. The rest of you, dismissed. Mission reports are filed, Commander. You want me to patch you through to the council? Put him through. Patch him through, Joker. Setting up the link now, Commander. We've received your report, Commander. I understand Dr. Tassoni is on the Normandy. I assume you're taking the necessary security precautions. Don't tell me how to do my job. You are free to act as you see fit, Commander. Our role is to offer guidance and advice. It's up to you if you're smart enough to listen. Liara is on our side. The Geth were trying to kill her. Benezia would never allow Saren to kill her daughter. Maybe she doesn't know. Or maybe we don't know her. We never expected she could become a traitor. At least the mission was a success. Apart from the utter destruction of a major Prothean ruin. Was that really necessary, Shepard? We almost died in there. The Geth were everywhere. Of course, Commander. The mission must always take priority. Good luck, Commander. Remember, we are all counting on you. You don't sound like you're counting on me at all. You sound like you're trying to hinder me. Especially the friggin' Turian Counselor. Hey, what an absolute bellend. God. Anyway, guys, this is the end of the episode. Thank you very much for watching. If you liked the video, drop a thumbs up and be greatly appreciated. Subscribe for more content, and I will see you in the next one.